even if I get stressed out. Patients will never stop coming. And as long as patients are there, you have to be ready for them. That's one of the things that keeps me going, that our patients will never stop coming. So we should never stop serving. When I joined MSF, there was a big gap in my profile. I worked as an anesthesiologist. So by the time I went on mission, hindi na bago sa akin yung complications that I'm seeing. When I saw it, I knew what to do with it. Kasi that's what happens when you go to the field as an expatriate. Ikaw yung pupuntahan ng mga doktor mo. Hindi na nila alam ano gagawin nila. If you don't have the clinical experience, anong ibibigay mo sa field? That is the point. The practice here in the Philippines, yung residency ko dito, yung clinic work ko dito, it helped me a lot in treating the complicated patients na nakukita ko at nahahandle ko when I went on mission. Kasi here, the good part with medyo kulang sa budget dito, some of our hospitals are not as equipped as one might have hoped for. Once you go to the field, ang bilis, ang galing ng Filipino doctor to adapt because of that mindset. Na pagdating sa field, ah, I have this medication, this, this, and this, yeah, we can work with that. And not to belittle naman yung nakikita nyo sa field, it's not as low resource as what as you might think. Actually, minsan mas advanced pa as other hospitals here. You also have to learn and know your limits as a person. Because if you don't, your tendency is to just accept everything. So you always have to remember, there is a manager who always has your back. Hindi ka nag-iisa. You think you're alone, but you're not. When you realize that you have too much work to do, then you realign with your manager. Sa akin, very important as a manager's communication. So you have to make sure that channel is open and they don't feel blocked in any way. When I was working in anesthesiologist, there was a time na I worked as a mentor for my anesthetist before. Particularly in Congo. Yun, hindi ko makalimutan yun. Kasi I did it in three months. They started as nurses by the time I left. They're already doing it on their own. So, ang sarap na feeling when you see ngayon, nurse, they work as nurse anesthetist na. So, ang ganda tignan yun. Ang sarap tignan na, and you know that you're a part of it. It's a nice feeling. Iba yung rewards. Iba yung fulfillment. Iba. Iba. When you go to the field. Iba. Ibang iba when you do your private practice. So, if you have that curiosity, pursue it. Pursue it. You don't have to stay very long. You just need to go on one mission and try. Don't leave your curiosity hanging. Hi, my name is Karina Aguilar. I'm an anesthesiologist. 